Hello from the Happy Heretic. Um, we have decided, I have decided, to let the chickens loose in the big compost pile. And they are finding so, oh, they love it. As a matter of fact, I let them out earlier with the intention of, um, I've been letting them out at night because they put themselves to bed. You don't have to chase them, which is awesome. But um, they have a smaller, much smaller compost pile in their run, but um, I like to let them out at night cause, so they can get, they can run around, they can, but they put themselves up. I don't have to chase them and there's no drama. And this typically is closed to keep, well, everything out. But the other, I think yesterday, I showed them where it was. And today when I let them out, I couldn't find them. Um, I came outside and I was like, where did they go? And I walked around to the side of the house and they were standing outside of the fence, scratching it. <laughs> they, they remembered. And I told Paul, I said, it won't take but one time and they'll know where this is. So I propped the door open so they can get in and out. And they are absolutely loving it. And they are getting huge juicy worms and every imaginable living thing in there. And what's funny is sometimes, well, she just got a worm. Let's see, did you get it? Um, lots of worms in there, not my worms, regular worms that you would find in there. She's got one too. So this is a great dinner for them. And I think I'm gonna do it most nights. In the evening, an hour or two before it gets dark, I'll let them out. They'll come over here, and again, it, it only took one time, and they knew where it was, and let them do their thing. It's good for the compost. It's good for them. It's a great source of protein, and um, I don't know if um, some of you knew this, but black soldier fly larva, for instance, and there's usually that in the compost pile. They love it, but it's a great source of calcium, um, and a lot of people, I don't think, knew that. I know I didn't to begin with, and they have found some. I see Gail over there with it. But anyway, so they're getting calcium, they're getting protein, and any number of other things. So I really love this system. It's kind of what my whole setup is. It's the chickens, the worms, the compost, the garden, the vegetables. Um, more leaves, yay! I just raked up a ton of more leaves and Paul's moving them for me. Say hi, Paul! Hey, everybody. Hi, everybody. Um, and he's been really helpful. He helped me harvest a bunch of adult red wigglers today to put into a another tray because I, I have so many now I'm, I'm splitting the trays up moving slowly moving a lot of my um, stock indoors so that I can manage it better but anyway I just thought everybody would like to see what we're doing and it's working again so well and in another month or two at least one of them because they're four different types at least one of them should start laying in the next month or two so then I will I will have fresh eggs and I will have eggshells for uh, the worms and it's all kind of coming together so this is a happy Christina the happy heretic and like it if you like it subscribe if you want to see what I'm up to on any given day and ring the bell uh, YouTube is not showing a lot of the shorter videos thanks bye